First, use a Type-C data cable to connect the gravity electronic ball to your computer. If the connection fails, try replugging the Type-C cable into the computer several times. Once the gravity electronic ball is connected to the computer, you will see an additional USB drive appear on the computer. This indicates the connection between the gravity electronic ball and the computer. Inside, you will find three folders, set, game, images, and videos. The set folder contains system files, so please avoid making any modifications to it. If you need to add images or videos to the electronic gravity ball, simply copy the files into the corresponding folders after they have been appropriately cropped and converted to the required format. The image files must be in PNG format, and the image aspect ratio needs to be cropped to 1 to 1. The video files must be in JPEG format, and the video footage needs to be cropped to a 1 to 1 aspect ratio. The following are all materials I created myself. Now I will teach you step by step how to add video materials to the gravity electronic ball. Step 1. Let's open the prepared video material file. This footage of Labubu riding a bike was downloaded by me from TikTok. The Labubu biking video material is an MP4 format with a 916 aspect ratio. To use it, you will need to convert it to MEPEG format and adjust the aspect ratio to 1 to 1. So we need to use video editing software to crop the video to a 1 to 1 aspect ratio. I use CapCut for video editing. This is our cropped one-to-one -one video material of Labubu riding a bike. Step 2. Convert the video material from MP4 format to MEPEG format. Open the picture and video conversion tools, zip file that I have prepared for you. The download link for the file is in the video description. I have already downloaded the software to my computer in advance. Unzip the picture and video conversion tools. Zip file. After extraction, you will get for files. There is an image transcoding tool available. There is a video transcoding tool, and we currently need to use the video conversion tool. Click on the video conversion tool, then select open file. Choose the one-to-one -one cropped video material of Labubu riding a bike that we prepared earlier. Please do not modify any other software parameters. Click start conversion. Then a message will appear indicating that the conversion was successful. After the video format is successfully converted, an MEPEG format file will be generated in the original files directory. At this point, you are 90% complete. Step 3. Simply copy and paste the MEPEG file of the Labubu biking video material into the MEPEG folder, which is the video folder created when the gravity electronic ball is connected to the computer. For consistency, I usually name all my video materials with my as the prefix followed by a numerical sequence. If you prefer not to rename them, you can leave the file names unchanged.
After renaming the video material, simply copy and paste it into the MyPEG video folder, which is created when the gravity electronic ball is connected to the computer. At this point, you can unplug the gravity electronic ball from the computer and enjoy watching the video material you imported. Please note that if the video file format is incorrect or the file size is too large, the gravity electronic ball may malfunction. If an error occurs, reconnect it to the computer and delete the recently imported material. This will restore the gravity ball to normal operation. Finally, let me demonstrate the video preview tool. This software allows you to preview video materials that have been converted to the MiAPEG format on your computer. In the future, if you have a large number of, this tool will make it easier for you to identify the content of the video files. Thank you for watching. Wishing you a wonderful day. Bye.